Welcome to your second Christmas video. So let's just get going. We're going to stay on the mats to start with this one. So we're going to take it down, heels underneath the knees, feet level with the seat bones. So we just start off by mobilising that lower back. So push the lower back into the mat, bring the glutes off the floor, the bottom off the floor, sorry, but leave them back on the mat. It's like a rhyme, that. And again, so we're doing a pelvic tilt. And as you tilt, draw the pel uh, pubic bone towards the belly button. Keep the collarbone nice and open and breathe. Let's do one more. Good. Excellent. Take your arms out to the side and keep the legs together. We're just going to take it to a Russian twist. So again, we're mobilizing this back. Breathing out, use the center as you come back up, breathing in, take it the other way. So this is brilliant. Again, if you've just been stressed, running around, not thinking about you, just to take a little bit of time out for you. Okay, let's do one more each side after this. And last one. So again, you can do more of these. Uh, just doing this for the purpose of the video, we're just doing a few reps. Good. From there, we're going to take our legs up one at a time into our tabletop position, arms above the head. So we're going to breathe out, curl up, lengthen the fingertips, lower those armpits, take the upper body down. And again, breathing out and take it down. One more, we're going to hold it here. Lengthen those arms, lengthen those legs, heels together if you can. You can take them wherever you want. If you want to keep them bent, that's fine. Start breathing in for five, breathing out for five. If you don't want to keep your head up, that's fine too. Take it down onto the floor. But what I do want you to do is just lower those armpits and draw the pubic bone towards the belly button. So focus again on that breathing. In through the nose, out through the mouth. And you just focus on that, that clears your mind and helps you concentrate on the exercise. We'll do two more. And again, last one. Brilliant. If you can, lower those legs to the floor, otherwise bend them and take them down. You don't want to let your back come off the floor. We're going to take it into a roll up. If you can't do this from the floor, sit yourself up. So we're going to engage the glutes, we're going to push the lower back to the mat. Breathing out, and then as you lift your head, start to breathe out. So from there, we're going to take it forward into our spine stretch. And again, sit nice and tall. So if you're not going to the floor, that's absolutely fine. Just go to where you can, but focus on those shoulders. Keep the armpits lowered. Take it down to the floor. Breathing out as you can't lift the head. Keep that curve. Look at your tummy, look at your thighs, and take it forward. And one more. So glutes working, keep tilting, draw up through that center. Last one, taking it forward. Good, and relax. Good, from there, we're gonna take it into the saw. So sit up on your seat bones, so you're sitting nice and tall. If you need a cushion, do so. Heels wide, sorry, legs wide, heels into the mat. Take the arms out to the side. So we're going to do a spine twist to start and then tilt. Take it back into a spine stretch. Good. When you do this, you both bum cheeks are supposed to be on the floor. And again. And take it the other way. Excellent. So we're putting both heels on the floor, both bum cheeks on the floor, and it's all about the stretch. It's not about how far you can go. Last one. Okay. And again. And take it down. Well done. Good. I hope you enjoyed that. See you tomorrow.